guys welcome back to turner's turn up in today's video i want to take you guys on a quick review of our room at the homewood suites in new orleans louisiana we stayed at the location at 901 poydra street once we arrived we were notified that the location does not offer self-parking so you do have to use valet parking at 42 dollars a night We immediately noticed that the hotel was clean and fresh and that it had been recently renovated, so we were excited about that. Hey guys, we are in New Orleans, Louisiana, and I want to take you guys on a quick review of our room. We are here at the Homewood Suites by Hilton. So we're going to start here in the kitchenette. We did get a suite because uh, it's Mardi Gras and we got a lot going on for this particular visit. So I would like you guys to see just how spacious this room is. One of the things we like about uh, suites during Mardi Gras season in New Orleans is we do like to get a full kitchenette because once Ash Wednesday comes and goes, none of the restaurants, a lot of the restaurants are not open or you just have limited options. We don't like crowds, so we do prefer to grab takeout somewhere and we will uh, warm it up and we want to have the options of a full kitchen. And so far so good, we're really impressed with what we have. So this is the living room area. So nice and spacious. I like this little light here. Got to figure out how to turn it on. And you have a television, TV. I like, so nice. So we're gonna really be able to relax here. And let's see what type of, eh, well, oh, we have what looks to be a balcony. I'm not sure if it's functional or not. We have a balcony, how nice is that? So anyway, that is our view. We have a little balcony and I will see if we can get that open later. But just to continue our review of our suite. Okay, so this is the bedroom area. So nice, love it. We love it so we both can have the space that we need to get ready. There is a full television in here as well. Okay. Again, have a little nook area here. And we already see there's not much of a view. However, we're not here for the view. We're gonna be out attending parades, galas, concerts, and more. But that's the little view that we do have. I like it. Okay, so. This is the room, and we have a little side console here. Ooh, look at the outlets. So you get outlets for both, on both sides of the phone. Love it. So this is like a full bedroom. So we have plenty of space for, to get ready in. Okay, and here, another outlet. Okay, on the side table. You have your typical phone. We don't use it, but there it is. Okay. 
Okay, so let's look at our bathroom. One of the things we like about this bathroom, so even though it's only one, but there's two doors and you can access the bathroom from the bedroom area. Here. And I'll show you how, how you can get in from the kitchen. Here's the vanity. Oh, it's so spacious, y'all. It is absolutely gorgeous. I'm excited. We won't have to compete for space. And look at the wallpaper. Oh, I like it. Okay. So this seems to be a, uh, a handicap accessible shower. But it works for us. We like it. This is enough space to do what we need to do. I did not plan on soaking this trip. It's going to be a really busy Mardi Gras trip. We're packing a lot of activity into this trip, however. Oh, this is not an opening, so there is only one entrance. Okay, this is the closet area. Yes, I love having extra blankies because y'all know how i am about my surfaces i may need to cover a surface in here with those clean blankets okay so so you have your iron have your lovely handy dandy laundry bag we have our clean blankets love and that pretty denim-like wallpaper runs all throughout the closet. This is so nice, guys. I really, we're excited about this thing. Uh, but yes, this is our bathroom. Okay, so, yeah, so this is a suite here at the Homewood Suites on, at, uh, it's on Poydras, Poydras Street in New Orleans. Okay, so I did figure out how to open the balcony door and I just wanted to show you guys, sorry about the sirens. We have a bit of a balcony here. It's really small, there's no furniture and it only faces this little side street here, but it provides a good opportunity to get fresh air if you need. All right. Okay, so I want to point out that we noticed that evening while showering that there was a major design flaw with the shower floor there. And I don't know if it's due to to make it wheelchair accessible. However, when you're in this particular shower and you're showering, I the dip where the drain is located in the floor is just not deep enough in my opinion. And the water tends to run out of the shower pan onto the floor and it could be a bit of a disaster. It gets really messy. So we found ourselves using towels just to kind of catch whatever spillage that we had because we just didn't want a wet bathroom floor. But uh, yeah, that was, I will say that was, mm, I'm not gonna say it didn't ruin our stay, but it was one of the low points of the visit. Another part of the visit that I felt like could stand some improvement was the breakfast part. Our visit was during Mardi Gras celebration, so the hotel uh, it appeared to be full, maybe to capacity. However, the next morning we got up and went to breakfast at about, I would say at about eight. So it wasn't super early, but it wasn't late either. And most of the food was out 
uh, there was like one attendant there and she was struggling to kind of keep the food, the breakfast bar stock. But you, as you can see here, there's just not much there. Overall, we enjoyed our stay at the Homewood Suites. We would definitely stay at this location again. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. If you're new to our channel, don't forget to hit the, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. See you next time.